Hello ladies and gentlemen, KV here, and we are in the Pirate Water 1 newsletter. I will go ahead and put the link in the description so you could read it for yourself in case you want to see this video. I usually don't watch the videos, um, or I watch it in my own time. Uh, okay, so, let's begin. I haven't even looked at this. So, can you believe it's June when you're not out enjoying the sun? Uh, yeah, it's gonna start getting hot. Ooh, yep. Alright, it's going to be a great time to escape the heat with a few of your pirate pals in Pyro 101. May was a great month that was full of holidays and celebrations, but the big news was that our spring 2014 update left the test from docks and arrived safely in the live game. Finally. Anyways, um,. Advanced Pants, Advanced Companions, the Skull Island expansion, which takes forever, and much, much more just took our game into a whole new level of fun. Well, it would be fun if we had an update of a new world, but I guess whatever. Anyways, while um, we're working on all kinds of new stuff here in King's Island, and especially a little something in Mushu for higher level players, hopefully we're going to get... Um, Seems like they're um, giving us, gonna give us something to format, which is good because I have pretty much nothing to format in Pirates. Um, so once that comes out, you know I'll be there definitely. Um, let's take a look back in May and devout into some fun Pirate One information. Thanks for reading, true fans of Pirate One once. Yeah. All right. So, uh, gallery this time is on Cortez, um, or the Golden Monkey, um, right. So, you know him well from your adventures in Skull Island and beyond. Here's a closer look on the infamous Cortez. Alright, so I'm not going to watch the video, um, in this video, um, I'm just going to keep reading. Welcome to the private one, Rogue Gallery, subject Cortez, born in a poor background corner of Monquista, Cortez was born to um, Commodores, the son of Stone Manson. Cortez ran away from home at the, an early age, drawn by the call of adventure and destiny. Extraordinary cunning and strong even for a gorilla, Cortez won his first name as a mercenary. Over several years, he, his mert earned him a place among the nobility as a monquisador hero about whom songs were sung all over Monquisa. Cortez's humble beginnings left him with little, little patience for the uh, pleasantries and intrigues of Monquisa society, chafing under the um, immense weight of expectations and antiquity. Um, Cortez spent most of his time in the field con conquering new lands for the glory of Monquisa. In recent months, Cortez turned his sights on the dark corner of Skull Island, the island, the Isle of Doom. The gorillas marched into the deepest jungle at the head of the of his elite, hand-picked legion of Bonquisadors. He has yet to return. These pirates and more await you when you play for free at Pirate101.com. Um, there's only so much you can do for free. Um, Alright, and then here is the party, I guess, in the test round. Alright, um, way back in May, in the beginning of May, when the current updates were still in the test server, we held a really fun party to test out the limits of the um, pet sparring and made our announcement and the players came in numbers. If you intended, you were awarded with a free uh, metal eye patch for redeeming a code and several lucky few even one a hoodoo bundle. Oh, well, I did not know about that. I know about, I knew about the party, but I was like, eh, I don't want to be in the video. Psh, I could be in my own video. All right, it was great seeing everybody there, and we um, really appreciated the feedback. Best of all was this fun Vine video was captured as pirates having a blast. All right, um, spring has sprung. Uh, we just want to say thank you to the sites that cover our spring update. Um, okay. And another puppet pirates. Um, I know 
Yum can heal most anything, but I think your buddy there is beyond help. Haha, <laughs> it's funny. Okay. Um, pirates, they mile. Every May 5th, our pirates get a special cold round surprise with a pirates, they mile celebration. Several companions were marked on a sale on the crown shop and notably, um, Corridor and we featured a new um, Pacho de Mayo. If you enter the code, you even got a free sombreros to um, celebrate the fun. A couple of our fans even sent pictures of themselves proudly displaying the Pirates de Mayo pride. Thanks, Pirates. All right. Anyways, uh, the Book of Culture. Pirates, do you like hidden treasures? Valencia is rich with them, and I, I always skip the book once. Uh, I, the librarian, uh, love tales involving hidden treasures of all type. Alright, I'm not interested of your, you usually don't give us, um, stuff. Mother Day Spotlights. Mother Day was a special place in the hearts of our fans, and we just wanted to share two really fun pieces of Mother Day fan art. Um, we received of companions and their moms. Um, Kings I love fans art like this. Thanks, Pirates. Um, Lucy, uh, Lucy Steele and her mom for Mother's Day from John. That's cool. And then we have um, Baby Barnabas and his mom for Mother's Day um, from Nicholas. Again, also cool. Alright. Um, to check out more fan out and to submit some of your own, maybe make sure to visit this page well you know i do do some of my own uh pictures for my thumbnails maybe one day you'll see my art on that website <laughs> anyways fan sites information galore so here's a bunch of fan sites i'm not too interested in that you could go ahead and look at it for yourself all right what there's nothing there's nothing determining what is new. Hints from one eye Jack. Who needs bed rest? I've seen a few me messages from players who are frustrated about how companions are wounded and unusable for several hours if you're high level. Just to be sure, you know these companions definitely still have a use. Let this break down your options when a companion goes into bed rest. You may choose to wait for the um, bed rest timer to expire. This is not really putting your companion to good use other than bringing them faster healing, which may or may not be the best option. All right, so I feel like I'm gonna have a problem with that in the future, um, especially since I'm doing my Pirateer, and yeah, you know, go check that out, Pirateer. Um, I do that in a live stream. Um, I'm probably going to live stream um, soon. Um, make sure you follow my Twitter um, because I'll always post it there when I, before I actually do a live stream. And then usually I make a video and post it on YouTube before I even live stream. So yeah, I think everybody should be cool. Um, anyways, um, you may choose to make a visit to uh, Miracle Mitch in Avery's Court. Miracle Mitch is a new... NPC who uh, um, yeah, sorry, acquires a brand new building besides the Swash Buckler training house. Yeah, we already know about him. I'm not even going to finish reading that. We already, I already talked about that a bunch of times. <clears throat> you may choose to wake your companions from bed rest early by canceling their bed rest orders, but they will suffer penalties in combat. The more times they been wounded without recovery the worse the penalties become but a companion can only ever have three wounds and perhaps the most interesting to me you may alternately choose to wake your wounded companion from bed rest send your wounded companions on a job to collect experience while they heal um, and a deeper into it, your pool of companions to find other companions for your wait what a deeper into your pool of companions to find other companions to, to find in your crew. That's right, companions can have a wound timer expire while 
completing a job order. Advanced companions have really changed some basic strategies, concepts in Pirate 101, and it's important to not overlook all you can do with them. If a companion is wounded, it might just be an opportunity to make them grow faster. Alright, so there wasn't any information on anything new that was going to come out, so I'm kind of disappointed. Um, I think they're actually focusing more on wizards um, for a while. Um, I don't know why. Um, they like they released Chrysalis and they're already giving them another update. Like, really? What about Pirates? You gave us one update like this whole year, and you already have like you're gonna have two or two like major ones for Wizards already. Like we, this wasn't even really an update. It was just like, oh, let's. Let's just make a bad companions and stuff. Yeah. I I mean, I guess maybe, hopefully, they're making something, like, really hard. Um, so people actually have a challenge or something. Um, but again, I don't know what they are planning. Hopefully, it's something big. Like, I'm ready for something big in Pirates. Like, ugh, I just can't wait. Um, they're probably... I don't think they're gonna release anything new this year. Uh, I'm just calling it like right now. Um, I know they're gonna release that uh, the Mushu thing, the which I think we're gonna farm for stuff. Um, hopefully it's level 65 gear that we farm for. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be cool. I'm definitely gonna be doing that as soon as it comes out. <clears throat> Even in the test realm, maybe. Um, I may do that. I don't know. It depends what happens in the future. Um, but yeah, I don't think they're gonna... I don't think we're getting a new world this year. Maybe... Maybe in the fourth quarter. Maybe. Ah, uh, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't count on it. <clears throat> I don't know. We'll see what happens, I guess. So that's gonna go ahead and be it for this newsletter. So make sure you guys leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video and make sure you subscribe so you're notified when I post new content of Pirate 101. And make sure you go check out my Pirateer series <clears throat> because that is fun. Also, if you can, make sure you be part of a live stream. Um, there's going to be a lot of live streams for that series. The whole series is um, live stream. There may just be like a few videos that are not like something um like i think the only thing that may not be um live stream is like um training companions and getting the promotion that may be like the only thing i would do like off camera or off the live stream but i'll still record it i don't know it depends i'm not really 100 percent sure on what's gonna happen um in the future with that series um but i'm gonna try to live stream like everything so you guys to be a part of it. Anyways, that's gonna go ahead and be it for the video. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. And until next time, I have been KV and I am out. Peace.